Now, let's add a script which will automatically choose from a list of IDs on our page. So let's go ahead and add the script first, and we'll add our script to our JavaScript window here. So let's just scroll all the way down to the bottom, and we'll paste in our script. And basically, you can create as many uh, random links as you want. Just remember, we start at zero, okay? So zero is the first. And then you'll notice we're just adding the ID which we want to jump to, okay? So I have included within this array or this list all of the IDs that um, are in or target each of the sections or each of the elements which I've created, which I have a, a, a menu uh, list item already going to, okay? <clears throat> All right, so our function is random link. So let's go ahead and now get what's going to um, call this function. So let's find our list. There's our list for our menu. So let's just drop down and we'll paste in, and then I'll have to fix the formatting here. All right, so basically what we're doing now is we're going to add recipe me. This is just what's going to show up on the screen as a link and our overlay with the rest of our links. So if you wanted this to be a button somewhere else in your project, then you just need to include this href and whatever type you want. You could use an image also, okay? An image source instead of an ally for this. So what we have here now is our href is a JavaScript and it's calling the function random link, okay? Which is this function right here which is basically getting at this list of IDs which have been placed inside of our array, okay? So let's see if this in fact works correctly here. So let's go ahead and save and we will preview and let's inspect. And so we're on our home page. So let's go ahead and hit or select the recipe me. And we went to list one. Let's try this again. And we went to list one. Now it's possible because there's not that many IDs that will go to the same one uh, more than one time in a row. So there we went back to home list three, profile. All right, so let's just go back home. And there you go. A pretty straightforward uh, JavaScript, which creates a, uh, uses a variable, places an array or a list of elements into that variable, and then a script, which basically goes into that list and randomly selects one of the IDs. So this could be a cool feature to add to your recipe project to just uh, let the user uh, be surprised by what recipe is selected for them.